35 members of the House of Representatives under the auspices of reform-minded lawmakers have proposed a bill for an act demanding the constitutional alteration to provide for the rotation of executive powers among the six geopolitical zones. This, according to them, is to ensure equal representation and reduce the desperation and tempo of agitation for the creation of states. Addressing the media conference, they say they are committed towards using the instrument of lawmaking to reform Nigeria and her political process. The lawmakers, through its spokesperson, Honorable Ikenga Ugochinyere, said this bill will aid in the reduction in government spending and wastage, efficiency in governance and national stability by providing a single term of six years for the president and governors will go a long way in cost-cutting measures. And to seek the buy-in of Nigerians and our distinguished colleagues. And these bills are centered on the following foundation a single tenure of six years, rotation of power between North and South and among the geopolitical zones and the senatorial zones for the governorship, and also single tenure for the presidency and single tenure for the governorship six years, removing the billions we spend in re-election and the uncertainty it brings to the electoral process plus the corruption it also brings. And also, we are seeking for all elections to be conducted in one day reducing the cost of conducting election, getting more citizens involved on election day, and reducing to the barest minimum the possibility of rigging because you will have those interested in the presidency, in the governorship, in the state assembly, in the national assembly, in the local government, all turning up to vote for their different candidates. According to them, the highly sought and proposed constitution changes will enhance political stability and governance efficiency in the country. Also, they noted that they have taking a crucial step that will further strengthen understanding, expand the frontiers of inclusiveness, deepen the bond as one under God, and build a stronger support that will deepen Nigerians' democracy and electoral system. What we are here doing is, that, is to tell the world that our economy, our progress, our good governance is tied to good and uh, effective and transparent election. If we don't have good election, I don't, there's, no, there's no way uh, you can give what you don't have. If you come by bad election, you give us bad election because you want to sustain what you're coming with. The people of the country are tired of the, of the vicious circle. Every year, election reform, every year, election reform, and we have reformed nothing. We're also pushing for all pre-election matters to be settled 30 days before election to avoid the situation that people are sworn in and we are still in court on who is the candidate of that political party. And also, that post-election uh, litigation should focus only on the outcome of the election, not on the things that happened before the primaries. The bill summarizes unity. It talks also about peace and stability of Nigeria. We believe that for any development to happen, we must be united in Nigeria, and Nigeria must be peaceful. And it is on this purpose that we look at it that coming up with a single term, most especially looking at uh, a rotation from the south and from the northern part of Nigeria, it can provide some stability to Nigeria and we'll be able to work together to enhance development. The lawmakers, however, added that the proposal is currently under discussion within the legislature framework and further updates on its progress and potential implications are anticipated. Ani T. Patrick Ko, TV News, Abuja.